I remember standing outside of my house, deciding to leave, using my key for the last time. I was a victim of narcissistic abuse, and it was something that plagued my life, plagued my marriage for 19 years. And I couldn't leave before. I didn't have the strength. I didn't have the courage. I didn't have the help. But all those years, it, I had to come to a place where I was ready. And this was that moment. A lot of times when we think about abuse, we think of when someone has hit you. But the emotional and verbal abuse is just as bad. It's something we don't talk about. And unless you've been hit, you don't think that it's something that should be said. But it was a powerful, it was a powerful message, a powerful moment for me to decide that I needed to go, that I needed to do this, not only for myself, but for my children, for my daughter. And it's something that, as I walked it, I got the strength, and I got the um, more courage but it's something that we, we think about, that we may see, but sometimes we don't act on what it is that we need to do because we're stuck doing what we've always done. And so that is, that is the story that has shaped the last few years of my life. Oh.